All right there vloggers, welcome back to another video at Dan's again. Uh, so, I did a video for the for the riding channel. Sorry, I'm trying to stretch my back right now. Uh, trying not to make it weird here. <laughs> but I did a video for the riding channel. Uh, yeah, I was just basically t telling them that uh that the uh, Hoffman and the Iron Horse are going away and and uh yeah so I tried uploading the video at work before I left because I Went up and got a shake. <laughs> then I get, went home. Did some shit at home. So I, then I... <laughs> I was just letting it go up there. You know, go there. Uh, so I don't know if it uploaded. Probably not. Uh... So, uh, yeah, and, uh, so I don't know if it uploaded. I'll upload it tomorrow when I go to my grandparents for Mother's Day, so. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't want the uh, Hoffman to go, but I really don't ever ride it anymore, so. Yeah, so it's gonna have to be. I mean... I got no hits on it. I mean, I got a few, but I got pissed off at a guy because he changed, he had a change of plans. He couldn't make it and didn't fucking tell me until it was like six o'clock at night when we were supposed to meet. So, and the dude is Seems like he know what he was talking about. You know, I do too. I know, I know my bikes, but apparently people think they know better when they actually don't. And that's the truth right there. Don't mean to, mean to be a stickler, but that's how I have to be sometimes, I guess. But, um, uh, yeah, so I was supposed to have a guy come, yes, not yesterday, like two days ago, three days ago. It was earlier this week, it was like Monday or Tuesday, he was supposed to come look at the bike. It, maybe it was Wednesday, it was one of those three days. And... He's like, he messaged me in the morning, you know, before I was getting ready for work. He's like, asking me a bunch of questions about it. He's like, is it okay if I come look at it? I said, yeah, I'll be open. It was Wednesday. It was Wednesday, matter of fact, because I told my dad about it. And he's like, I'm stopping in by my, by my grandparents, his mom and dad. Telling the meat come at you know to be at the house for six. I was like, okay. So I 
I told him, hey, I'll be open. I, you know, I was like, I apologize, but I have to push it back an hour. I'll be open at six. I had something or the thing that I had to do ended up just being an hour longer uh, you know, or whatever. And he's like, yeah, no problem. I should be there around 6.15 ish. I was like, okay. When it gets close, and then I told him once it got, got close to the time of us supposed to be meeting up, I'll show him my address. And I was like, we got closer and closer. And, you know, we got about 5, 5.30 somewhere in there. I was like, here's my address for when you. For when you uh, start heading this way. Got nothing from him. Nothing from him. Nothing from him. You know, I waited like 15 minutes. You know, I was. So he was still kind of busy. So I was like. Something. Asked the master something else. Nothing, nothing, nothing. So then six o'clock hit. <sighs> Bug. Sounds like six o'clock hit. And I was like, are you coming? Because I got plans for later tonight too. He's like, no, plans changed. And I was like, yeah, he's like, is it okay if uh, he was like, sorry, your plans changed. Is it okay if I come and look at it tomorrow? I should have said, yeah, well, if plans changed, you should have told me when I messaged you my address. Then I would have decided from there. But whatever. I deleted his message, and, you know, I didn't want to talk to him anymore. You know, I know it's kind of stupid, but that bike really don't need to sell. I mean, I'd like it to sell, but it really don't need to sell. Not right now. And uh, I should have told him, yeah, well, you should have told me plans changed when I gave you my address or whatever. And, and uh, and, uh, I should have told him that, and I didn't, so I just deleted the message because I didn't want to deal with them anymore. I do not like dealing with people. When I was younger, I really didn't care. But right now, with especially what's going on around the world, no, I'm not going to risk it, you know, especially with I got family members that will die from this. And, uh... So I just left it, I deleted the post, reposted it. And then I never got any hits back. You know, I got a few. Messages, but not since I reposted it, so I'd rather have the mountain bike sell first, and then keep the Hoffman as like an idle on, on idle. You know, I'll still ride it, and then blah blah blah. And because uh, once my mountain bike sells, where my old mountain bike is sitting in the back garage at my house right now, this my new one will go there <laughs> and uh yeah so I don't know so I just want the bikes gone and I hate selling shit for this fucking reason like I oh, a while back before I bought my rustler I think it was like a month 
two weeks to a month before I bought my Rustler. And, uh, I wanted to sell my slash with my castle motor. And my dad's like, why? I was like, because I really don't need two slashes. I already got the one and the max. And I mainly won the, ran the one that I bought off my dad more. And... I wanted just only two, but whatever, I kept it, and now I got fucking four, but, and I had people down in fucking Florida, and trust me, I swear to God, everybody down, you know, in the lower part of this goddamn country are fucking stupid. You know, I'm just I'm not saying everyone, but I'm just saying some. Because one one guy down this guy down in Florida just tried buying the body that I had on it. And I was like, dude, I should have told him, dude, read the ad, I will not ship anything. And he was just to be it was like yeah, but I want the body action I should I would have told him, yeah, well, then you can fork out the $60, set, you know, the 60 or $80, duh, buy a brand new fucking body. Or buy the ones that already has that design, then just paint one your own color. Because my mom's got the same body as that one. And instead of where, you know, where mine's blue, my brother has the same body, but where mine's blue, my brother's is red. And where my brothers and mine are blue and red, my mom's is pink. You know, me and my mom and my brother and my dad, we all have the same bodies. Because the one on the one slash I tried selling, me and my mom and my brother have. And then I got an old body that used to be my mom's old body that now my dad has on his four by, you know, four wheel drive slash. And I have that body, the same body, but mine's all beat to shit. And then obviously I got a Hawaiian one as well. You know, I just run, I just run that beat to shit body for when I want to go hard. You know, I'm really tempted to see what my slashes will because right now the one that slash i tried selling i just put a valenin motor back in october early early november you know back before we actually got any like decent snow and i never really ran that i just ran it enough to try to get the steering situated and uh And uh, that was it. So then I brought the one that I just put the Valentin motor in when we went to Bay Shore this past weekend. Me and my dad went with, you know, ran across. The There's a, a limestone rock pile not too far from our tent site on the walking trail that's there. And I had one of my cameras on top of the slash, and I was running with it, and... And uh, rolled it and shot some video of that. So I got to upload it all that. And I I think I ended up deleting one, but I don't know. I don't remember. So I'm going to try to, well, I'm going to talk to my mom, my dad, and my brother to see if we can uh, go to my grandparents next Wednesday because I got next I think I got next Wednesday off and uh I was gonna upload all the riding videos I did at Bay Shore plus on my new bike and 
offload all those and get them done and done and over with and go fucking bike on the shit bike. I might bring some stuff with the uh, weld because I got another uh, rod to make a stake out of and try to get us some bolts for my bracket that I want to put on my bike for the cameras and my dad's like you're not putting any of your brackets on your new bike <laughs> it's my fucking bike I bought it you know I th thought about cause on this bike here I got a bolt there where that cable is for the shifter because here's the cable for the shifter the cable runs up goes over that bolt and then there's one on the other side that the cable for the disc brake is on the other side in the exact same spot I thought about uh, making a bracket conform to that frame and then have it fold and then be able to rotate it and but I don't know I might not until the bike gets older so anyway I'm running on 15 fucking minutes or uh, not 15 like 17 minutes here so I'll see you guys in the next video